course. When father told us about you, and who you were, it was clear he had certain biases. How could he not? He's your son. I'm proud of you. When he shared his plan for you to take his place, well, a lot of us thought that was more than just pride. It was narcissism. How would you, an outsider who knew nothing about us, run the Institute? We all had our doubts. Me, maybe more than most. But now, after watching the way you operate, well, I have to admit, I was wrong. It's clear to me now that Father knew what he was doing. And I should have trusted him. He seems to genuinely care about the Institute. I'm sure he only wants what's best. It's true. He's dedicated his whole life to it. I know that you haven't had much time with him. But I can tell you honestly, sir, Father is a great man. I believe in his plan for the future. I'll do anything in my power to make sure that future becomes a reality. Do I like wading through the filth that is the Commonwealth and all of its vermin? Of course not. But if that's what the Institute needs me to do, then I'll do it. My point is, you should be proud to call him your son. I am proud. I'm glad to hear that, sir. Anyway, I've said what I wanted to say. Thanks for listening. Right. Look, I'm not great with words. I'm more comfortable shooting people than talking to them. I'll just say that right up front. But sometimes, you have to say what's on your mind, because people need to hear it. It's all right, X6. Whatever's on your mind, you can tell me. Yeah, I'm getting to it. I'll just lay it out there. I look up to you. Now, before you give me shit about going soft or getting all emotional, just let me finish. All my life, I've always looked up to Father. You already know this. What you didn't know is, I was a lot less sure about you. I followed your orders because I had to, but you seemed, I don't know, unprepared. You looked lost and confused, maybe even scared. I didn't think you could handle this life and the work I do. I figured you'd just slow me down or get in my way. You weren't exactly seeing me at my best, but I understand. Yeah, I know that now. If I've learned anything since we've been running together, it's this. Holy shit, was I wrong about you. You're as tough and determined as anyone I've met. Maybe more, given all the things that have happened to you and everything you've lost. That's impressive. What I mean is, you have a sort of focus, a will. I think you could accomplish anything that you set your mind to. I'm not only sure that you can handle the task of running the Institute, I think you'll be the best leader we've ever had. Wow. Thanks, X6. I'm deeply honored at the compliment. You know me well enough by now to know that I mean what I say. Anyway, that's all. Thanks for hearing me out. Now let's get back to work. <laughs>